So as you can see, I play Warzone at 120 frames per second and I have a BenQ Zoe XL 11P monitor, which is connected to my PS5. If you have the same monitor type, you probably know that it doesn't support 120 frames per second or even higher through HDMI. So you have to have a DP cable attached to your PS5 to make it work. It was not easy to find a cable which can do the trick, but I finally found one and I wanted to publish this video to save you some time. I'll go through the steps, how to set it up both hardware and system side. The name of the adapter is the Club 3D HDMI to display port 1.2 4K at 60 Hz. Don't worry about the 4K at 60 Hz text because if you run games at low resolution, you'll get the 120 frames per second with this adapter without any problem. So this is an active adapter, which means that the USB end should be plugged into your USB port to power the adapter itself. So it has a USB male a DP female and an HDMI male output. Make sure to plug in your adapter's HDMI male end to your PS5. The USB should be plugged into a USB port to make it powered. And the DP female should be plugged into a DP cable and the DP cable should go to the monitor itself. So there you go. This is the hardware side. Let's see what's in the system. All right, so go to your PS5 menu, click on screen and video, go to the very bottom and it says enable 120 Hertz output, put that to automatic. Hint, if you don't see this option, then you probably did something wrong. Go back in the video and try to repeat the steps. So after that, go to the save data and game app settings and under performance or resolution mode, pick the performance mode. So that's it guys, you're ready to go to play Wars zone at 120 frames per second and in the future more and more games will release so hopefully you'll find this video useful for other games as well cheers <laughs>